Yo, what's going on gang? It's just that black guy back again. New video, you knew the vibes. As soon as you heard me say yo, you already know what's popping. Alright, so this video is going to be a story time about the time me and two of my friends hotboxed and stole a school bus. <laughs> well, I don't. I, I wouldn't say stole because we put the shit back. But whatever makes the title sound cool, I'm going to add it, you know? Alright, so let's just jump right into this bitch. So this was two years ago, like, r probably, like, during the summer, like, two, three months after COVID, because the COVID shit really started popping, what, March 2020 type shit? And this was, like, in June, July. So, yeah, a couple months after COVID started, niggas were still scared to go outside. So what did me and my friends do? We went the fuck outside. <laughs> we didn't do nothing crazy. We were just riding our bikes around the neighborhood. It was late at night. It was like 10, 11 o'clock. We were just at my house playing video games. And we was like, yo, I think we stopped at 7-Eleven to get some snacks. And then we was like, yo, let's just drive around. We decided to ride our bikes to one of our old campuses to the middle school we graduated from. So let me explain the campus. The campus, it's like, it's like two middle schools or elementary middle schools. I don't know. Is it intermediate? whatever it's called there's two elementary middle schools and then there's one high school so it's like you can stay at the campus from kindergarten till like till 12th grade just on that campus type shit but we was just there for for middle school and so we, we rode our bikes back to the campus it was late at night there was no cars there it was the middle of the summer so we didn't really expect to see anything or anybody in the campus when we were riding our bikes in there it was pitch black, there was a couple of lights on, but like that's really it. All the buildings were pitch black and empty. So we're riding our bikes through the campus, just chilling, vibing, smoking a J. And all of a sudden we just see on one side of the campus that there's like a whole line of just school buses, like big, long, yellow school buses just parked up. And we're pretty confused. We're kind of intrigued and we're also pretty confused because like it's the middle of the summer. Why are there school buses parked in this fucking campus, you know? So we, 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 you know, we some nosy ass little kids. So we went to the fucking school buses. We went inside one of them shits because the doors were open. I don't know why. I feel like it was a setup to this day. I feel like it was a setup, but I didn't get in trouble. No one got in trouble. So I'm chilling. All right. So we went on the school bus. My friend, uh, I'm going to call, call him. I'm going to call him Jay and I'm going to call the other one. Um, who I'm going to call the other one? I don't know. Um, Let me see. Stanley. <laughs> I just looked at this poster and just saw the name Stanley, so we're going to use that one. All right, so Jay, he he's the first person to go on the bus cuz he he was feeding trying to check if there was a fucking key inside and shit cuz he wanted to drive it. And me and my other friend Stanley, we just went in the bus. We was chilling in the back of the bus just smoking the Jay, chilling. And all of a sudden we're just sitting back booling, just fucking conversating. All of a sudden we <laughs> we hear the ignition turn and the fucking engine start going on on the bus. And we jump about the chair, kind of scared, like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> and my friend turns on the fucking bus, whips it out the fucking park, and starts driving the shit around the campus. At this point, me and, my, me and Stanley, we're like, wait, 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 wait. You're really doing this right now? In the middle of the night? You're wildin'. But, of course, we're smack, so we're kind of half... Like, yo, you're fucking up, you're fucking wallin', and we're half like, yeah, bro, keep doing this shit, it's lit, yo, <laughs> we're fucking lit, bro, I can't wait to tell people at school after this, like, yeah, we know we're all hype, so we we're doing all that and whatnot, getting crazy, still smoking a joint, my boy had the full J in his mouth, puffing the shit, while he was whipping the fucking bus, bro looked like he was, he was shooting a fucking music video, <laughs> the fucking bus was fucking all smoky and foggy, spoofing, <laughs> yeah, it was cool. So we were driving around the campus. There's still stoplights on the campus. Like, there's, like, two or three stoplights when you go around. It's, like, you just we were just driving in a, a big-ass circle, basically. Because the campus is, like, a, a, a big circle. And all the buildings are, like, just right in the center of the fucking circle. And there's just car parks. Cars parked all around it. Type shit. So we're driving around. We drive past the... There's a there's stairs that lead to a, to a gate. The entrance to the campus. We enter through the, the... There's a back gate that you can enter through where the cars go in from it's like it's like off a highway you like come off the highway and there's like a a back part of the campus you could just like kind of sneak your way into if you're driving a car so we just rode our bikes through there so we're, we're riding oh and i forgot to mention this actually we hit the bikes because we were we didn't want to 
we wanted to make sure no one came in the campus and saw the bikes on the floor and knew what was fucking going on. So we hit our bikes, three big ass bikes. We tried to hide the bikes under a bus. <laughs> I mean, it worked, but if someone came there, you would have obviously been able to see three bikes under a fucking bus. Come on now. But whatever. Um, so we're riding around. We drive past the gate and usually at the top of the gate, there's a, a police car that's always there just chilling. I never know if there's a person in the car or not, but the car is always there. I don't know why. So at this point, I guess my, my friend Jay, the one who's driving the bus, he's fucking, he's super smacked. So he's already super paranoid while he's driving because the bus is dumb loud. And there's literally no cars in the whole area. So you can only hear this loud ass bus engine driving and that's it. And just us in the in the bus screaming and hollering. They're like, yo, this is so cool. Like, oh my god, yo. <laughs> so he see he, he sees the fucking police cruiser chilling over there in the corner. And I don't know if he thought he saw a light go on or if he actually saw a light go on or if it was just a stoplight that's next to the bus. <laughs> or if he just smacked his shit. But he said, yo, he smashes the brake. M me and my friend on the back of the bus chilling. We go flying to the front. I damn near smash my head through the fucking window of the fucking bus. This dude opens the bus doors and just sprints out of there. Ta takes the joint out of his mouth. Tosses that shit, bro. Launches the joint. That shit is nowhere to be found. MIA is gone. RP the joint. Now it's over. I can't get smacked no more. It's gone. He fucked it up. He runs over. Leaves the bus in the middle of the fucking street at the stoplight. Right there in the middle of the campus. Doesn't even go to park it back. He just leaves it there and just dips. Goes, jumps on. He dolphin dives. He dolphin dives under the other bus where the bikes are. Grabs his bike. And starts dipping. <laughs> Mind you, me and my friend are still on the, on the bus. Just like trying to process what just happened. So I follow him. I'm like, okay, he's dipping. I'm dipping then. I didn't see no, no, no police cruiser light, but... I, Shit, if he said he's seen it, then I'm out. Alright, I'm not taking no chances. So we all skedaddle, we get our bikes, we dip out the campus. And after like 10 minutes, we're, we we ride back to my house. Because my house is like, what, a mile, maybe a mile and a half away from the campus? Not that far. We ride back, and we're chilling outside at my front. We're like right near my front steps, just on the bike still. And my friend Stanley, he's like, yo, yo, bro, you know we have to like put the bus back, right? And we all look at each other like, holy shit, we forgot to put the fucking bus back in the spot we took it from. We're definitely going to get fucking caught. And there's definitely cameras on the campus. Come on now. <laughs> so we have to go all the way back. Now at this point, it's like midnight. It's like past midnight at this point. We try to sneak back on the campus. We're mad cautious this time because the police cruiser that was up there before, it's not there. It's gone. So we're shivering in our boots. We're like, whoa, <laughs> hold on. We have to pull off some super ice to get this bus out of here. We, we, we're cautious before we go on the, on the bus because we want to check to make sure maybe there's a cop with a flashlight in the bus checking it out type shit. But there, lo and behold, there was nobody there. So my boy just goes back. My boy Jay just goes back on the bus, whips it back around the campus and parks it. He parked that shit terribly, but listen. <laughs> we left the key in the ignition, we left the car, we left the bus parked halfway on the sidewalk, because he fucking parked that shit terribly, and we just skedaddled, because we wasn't taking no risks. So yeah, uh, hope you like the story, that's my first story, I have many more stories to come, I'm kind of trying to space out the stories, because I don't want to tell all the stories mad early, and then like, if my channel blows up, have to retell all the fucking stories like that's mad work you know so i'm gonna try and save all the really 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 crazy stories for like when my channel pops off if that ever happens <laughs> i'm hoping on a fucking star right now <laughs> all right so if you like the video you know do what the fuck you want to do with it i don't really care like subscribe i don't give a fuck if you like and subscribe to be honest it's not my problem i'm just making the video because i wanted to peace one more thing before i do um if you want to play this game right here, I know y'all niggas was watching this shit like, yo, he's playing Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 1 or MW3. I'm confused. This is a custom client. It's called Plutonium. Look it up on Google. Download it. Shit's fire. Has MW3, Black Ops 2, World at War. It's pretty lit. I've been playing the fuck out of this. So, yeah. Quick shout out to Plutonium because this shit go crazy. And it's completely free. You don't even need their, You don't even need the base game. You do not have to buy MW3 to play this. It's fire. Alright. That's the end for Roto. Peace.